Let's move on to our next story. The presidency on Sunday being yesterday appealed to the National Assembly to reconvene as urgent matters pending before it may affect the running of Nigeria and matters affecting Nigerians. Now, the appeal was made by the SSA to the president on National Assembly matters, and this was a news conference that held in Lagos. The president of the Senate, Bakola Saraki, announced the adjournment at plenary following a motion on the siege on Mr. Saraki and the deputy Senate president, E.K. Ikwaramadu by security operatives. The Senate is now expected to reconvene on September 25th. NAN, however, reports that some of the pending issues um, before the adjournment include the approval of a supplementary budget to fund the 2018 budget and also the 2019 general elections. The supplementary funds would, be, would enable the INEC to commence preparation for the 2019 polls. You see these people? You remember I said that there are two classes of Nigerians? Now, let's look at how the system works. In order for them to spend quality time with their family members, because uh -uh, even though you are collecting 13.5 million running costs. as running costs, and you are working for the people hard, working hard in Abuja, working so that Nigeria will be good, you need some time to spend with your family and, you know, recuperate. So right now, what the message we are hearing from the National Assembly is, holiday, you know, it's not holiday, holiday mm -hmm. is coming. <laughs> Holiday is coming. No more morning bells. They, ha they, they will be gone for two months. Wait, come, come, come. Do they receive running costs while they take their holiday? Uh -uh. What are you saying now? No, me, I, I just want Nigerians. Let just me, let's, like, let's rationalize so, this so entire So that like a paid leave. Plenary is Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. You work on Mondays, Abby. You also work on Fridays. Sometimes on Saturdays. Sometimes, Saturdays. if they call you, if the person that pays your salary call you on Sunday, <laughs> the only saving grace you have is not to pick the call and claim that you did not see it. If you pick the call, you will walk the walk because the person pays you at the end of the month. Now, see, we understand that you must go on recess. It's very important that you do. Even the president is on a 10 day working in VK uh, in London. That was where he met uh, Senator Gossi Lafayette. That was shaking him <laughs> and bending down. Hey, God. Nigeria, I'm tired. See, let me tell you something <laughs> you need to understand. Until we begin to place priority on issues that affect the Nigerian people, people who are not supposed to occupy such positions, who occupy those positions and take us for granted. February 16th and March 2nd, 2019 elections, we have not even started the discussion on the supplementary budget of 2018 and then the budget for 2019 general elections. This is how you know those who do not even prioritize issues that concern you. I don't have any business with any member of the National Assembly. It's okay. But what I am saying is, whether in the executive or the legislative arm of government, if people do not understand that the reason why they occupy the position they occupy is as a result of the validation that the people came out en masse on election day to validate that mandate, then it's a waste of time. But I'm going to be sincere with you. You know, I don't used to... I don't, the last time I lied was when I was in primary school because I don't have anything to lose. In fact, if you come and carry me to even make me more popular. A lot of these people have no business in government. It's clear now. You cannot continue to live in a society where there's abject poverty and penury and you feel comfortable. No, I claim to be a clean person. Eh? I don't think I would feel comfortable sitting down in an environment that is not, that is untidy. I will never feel comfortable. I'm not just going to say, oh, I'm wearing a very, very expensive perfume. I'm looking all nice. But I am in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in an untidy environment. What we have is, you know, people who just feel, let us weaponize poverty and use it, I mean, a state governor that could not pay salary for seven months on the eve of the election was now sending alerts. People who claim that, oh, we are going to change Nigeria, these ones were paying 4,000, those ones were paying 5,000. And you have the people who will, because of they have been prohibiting by this same class of people, hunger, poverty, starvation, you know, wickedness, penury, they will just receive whatever they want to receive. Why? Because every time we say, it is where, it is not my portion. God will always look out for me. Hello? Hi. Hey, Gabriel is not going to come down from heaven with a testimony, with a manual to say this is how we are going to fix Nigeria. If we do not roll up our sleeves and decide today that we are going to begin to hold people accountable and responsible, we are going to continue to suffer. My parents, somebody on Aside Hot spoke of Nigeria. She, she said she's 50. She mm. told us she's 50. She spoke of Nigeria when there was uninterrupted power supply. I think she said it was in Delta State. Uninterrupted power supply. You know, our parents, when we were in the university, our lecturers would come and say, when we were in school, do you know that they used to even dry clean their outfits? Mm -hmm. 
If this same Nigerian higher institution, some people used to eat full chicken Chiku with did, ice cream. Chiku did, do you know that in this same Nigeria that you're talking about, currently there's some there's a village in Oyo, there's some parts in Oyo that have never seen electricity. Somebody in fact, I'm bringing somebody on the show. We're bringing somebody on the show who would come and share experiences. That individuals had to get, gather money together and get solar powered electricity. These villages had never seen electricity Can before. Can you imagine? Now, to enjoy more of this, our Ogunke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page.